This video is about how to fix a dryer that runs on natural gas, not electric. This is an old, older model. What I did is it's already set at 40 minutes. And you gotta press. We look in there, you can see the igniter goes on. But it does not ignite. And that's because right here. So let me shut this off. Well, okay, that's off. So we saw that the igniter did go on but not the, it didn't actually turn on. So what we need to change on this to make it work or to fix it is right here. You have two magnets. First of all, don't forget, there's a cover right here. Remove this cover so you can get in there. Maybe your dryer might be different. Here are the parts that I picked up. Oh, well, actually, I had them laying around. This is the part number. It's primary and secondary coil kit. So these two look similar, but they're not the same. So to change these. Mm, it's my screwdriver. Okay. First, what we need to do is put it a little closer so you can see better. Okay, you have one screw here and one screw here. Use a short Phillips screwdriver. I already got it loose, obviously, but before you loosen it, make sure you press on it pretty hard hard as you can like this and then twist till they snap loose once they're loose then you can just unscrew it take them out the same thing to this one pull that out oh the cover just fell right off okay now before you pull this cover off I forgot to mention I already did you have to loosen these these are pretty snug in there they obviously came loose easy because I uh, already got them loose. So you just have to pull on these. There's no connector that you gotta squeeze. This is a three prom. This is a two prom. And now you can see how it come right off. Make sure before you do any kind of work, you unplug the dryer just in case so now let's start with the bigger one here's the bigger one first one is the bigger magnet let's pull that out make sure you remember how it goes we're gonna pull this out see right here it's the old one This one's upside down. Then we'll grab this one. And put this back on. Then we'll take the second one. See there's a nipple right there. And this is got the problems on the top. Let's take this one out. Set it down here. And let's grab this nearer one and put it over. Now we're gonna put the bracket. You can see got the two nipple holes. They gotta match. One here and 
one here. So you might have to rotate this till it actually slides in, like so. Now we're just going to have to put the two bolts back on. It's one bolt, two bolts, and then we're going to tighten it. Don't tighten this one all the way down till you tighten this one almost all the way down to make sure that it is flush. Don't over tighten these. If you do have to remove them again, just snug them down. That's it. Plug in your pigtail connectors back in the switch. You can see, oh, this one moves a little bit. So does this one. You do this, hold against it, because if you don't, it might break this clips right off. Same thing here, put that on. That's a tough one, I have to set the camera down. Okay, now that that's on, let's take the light out. And before we put the cover back on, let's give it a try again and see if that will fix the problem. Set this at 40, press it down. have it. Now it's working. <laughs> you heard that click. These two are magnets and that's what triggers the that's what triggers the uh, flame to go on. So now that's working. <laughs> Set this to the side. Put the cover back on however this cover goes just hit that oops close that up you open it you just press right here again press right here hold it with one hand and I just pull this out Okay, I'll put that back on later. So these parts right here, sorry for the noise, these will cost you about $20. Like I said, I had these laying around. And I'm not sure which one goes bad. That's when you buy these, they come with two. So you don't guess which one's bad. 20 bucks is better than a new dryer or to call somebody to come and fix this for you, which they'll probably charge you easy $100 because they have to come to your place and uh, replace this so, so it's time and labor hopefully this video helped you guys out to understand what needs to be fixed or do it yourself and yeah if you have any comments just uh, leave me a message and don't forget to uh, give me a thumbs up and subscribe thank you